Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Dave. I'm a licensed podiatrist. I'd like to thank you for watching my video on my Frugal Foot YouTube channel. This video will explain why I never recommend the use of medicated corn removers that you can get over the counter for your calluses or corns. Now, these products, again, they're over the counter and they're designed to be used on corns, especially those that are like on hammer toes. That's what people call corns. And the calluses, well, they're simply thickened skin that is developing to protect the bone from the covering shoe that is rubbing the toe. Now, when you use these medicated um, corn removers, basically what they are is it's a pad like this that has an adhesive backing. So you peel the pad off of the strip and you're going to apply it to the corn, except that in the package also comes these adhesive medicated disc pads, and it's 40% salicylic acid. Salicylic acid is oftentimes used to treat warts, and 40% strength is pretty darn strong. So basically, you, you attach one of the disc pads to the corn and then cover it with the this cushion pad over the top of it, and you wear it like that. And the instructions say that you can wear it up to 48 hours. And you can soften the skin beforehand by um, soaking the foot in warm water or just uh, washing the foot first and softening the skin. They do give um, caution to individuals who might have diabetes or per poor circulation, but I'm going to tell you right now, I've had people come in my office that have good circulation and don't have diabetes that have used products like these and they have burned their skin pretty severely. And there's a lot of reasons why. First off, 40% salicylic acid, like I said, is pretty strong. And when you apply it to the corn, you're not necessarily treating just the corn. If the skin starts, if, if the disc pad starts to touch some of the normal skin, you're going to burn that as well. Remember, a lot of calluses are pretty thick. I mean, they might be a quarter of a centimeter thick. And when I see those patients in my office, I'm using a, a scalpel blade to trim all of that off. The idea behind one of these medicated disc pads is that you're going to replace using the blade and you're just going to burn it off with salicylic acid. Good luck. I did have a patient one time call the, call the office who had actually burned his skin right off and he had burned it his foot right down to the bone. You have to be very, very, very careful using these pads. I don't like taking that risk. I just tell my patients, don't use them, regardless of whether you have diabetes or poor circulatory uh, conditions. So I don't like these. I think you're far better off going to see your podiatrist, having it evaluated, having it debrided there, and then address the problem. If the shoe is not fitting correctly, get that problem fixed so you don't have to rely on these over-the-counter products that carry such risk. So be aware that fix your problem and don't just fix your symptoms. That's something that we need to do more of in medicine. Thanks for watching this video. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I'm Dr. Dave. I'll see you on my next video.